what what do you know 12 feet per hour so that's what we starting off with um and if because i starting off with this let's just write this here 12 feet in an hour all right so we got to set it up we got to set it up first and in this case like i mentioned with dimensional analysis you could do this in multiple steps one step is totally up to you okay so what i show you here this is how i did it okay this is how i'm doing it but you can easily do it a different way all right there's multiple ways to get to the answer here but this is how i this is how me you know me i'm going to go about and do it okay convert my feet to meters so i'm actually going to do this in one step get that first thing out the way and what we realize here right is that my feet canceled out and i'm going to be left with meters on top and what should the final unit be on top my meters right so right now my units is looking good okay the conversion factor i'm going to use is that there's 0 0.3048 meters for every one foot okay now now that i got that situated what can we do from here because my meters is good we see that that circle the only thing i need to worry about now is converting my hours to seconds right notice how this is set up right my feet go to meters that's going to be on top my hours to seconds that's going to be on bottom so we want to make sure that we're paying attention to where our units are going to end up everybody it's one hour right and if you got one hour how many what what can i convert that to well i, I know that there's 60 minutes in one hour i know that at least so my hours canceled out bam i left with minutes on the bottom okay but is this the unit that i want on the bottom no because what is this this is meters per second so what can i go to now so i could go from minutes to seconds right so my minutes are going to be on the top here got my seconds on the bottom there and I understand that that for every one minute, there's 60 seconds. And now my minutes is canceled. Mm. And what do we notice? My seconds is on the bottom. And what do we want to see on the bottom? Seconds. So my units is good. My numbers is good. So what can we do? We can multiply now. So this is where I really like the technique of multiplying across and dividing at the very end. Keep that simple. Two steps, two steps. Because if I didn't do it that way, what I got to do? I got to do 12 times 0 0.304. Then I got to divide it by 60. Then I got to uh, get that number. Then divide it by 60 again. It can get pretty complicated in your calculator, everybody. So what I like to do, I just like to multiply across 12 times 0 0.3048 times my one times my one okay and then i'm going to do the same exact thing on the bottom right because i understand that this is implied one here so one times one for my one foot times 60 times another 60 okay so now top number is going to be 3.6576. My bottom number will be 3,600. All right. And then from here, once you multiply across, right, this is one step. I multiply across, bam, bam. And then I just need to divide. So I'm going to divide 3.6576 by 3600 and what does that give me everybody my final answer is going to be 0 0.001016 meters over seconds everybody so how did you do how did you do on this uh episode everybody let me know in the comments please let me know in the comments how y'all doing out there and share this video with somebody who needs it all right share it 